I was just running down a hill and my knee sort of gave way and then after that basically I couldn't run um, had to fly back the next day uh, early so the UK doctors sorted it out and then I had a scan um, and it showed that it was sort of a bone injury on my patella um, which they th think has been caused by um, overcompensating when I was in the Great South Run running on the other side because I twisted my other ankle um, so I had uh, six weeks exactly off then I had another scan and now I'm back running uh, three weeks ago yes yeah three weeks yesterday and you're just getting back into sessions now uh, tempo, this is my first think? tempo today yeah so what you're gonna do is you're gonna do um, ten minutes yep uh, two minutes recovery yeah uh, then do seven and a half uh, two minutes recovery yeah seven and a half two minutes recovery and then we take a call on doing have you warmed up haven't you yeah, yeah. Uh, take a call on whether we do five minutes on the end or not okay, right so, 10, 7, so 7. you're going to do a bit more I think probably we'll go for the ten and the two seven and a halves and leave the five right starting to get back nicely. Um, this is only the second time she's run outside on the grass. She's been running mostly on the treadmill. And so today we really wanted to see how it was going to go. Um, basically she did 10 minutes, um, two minutes recovery, and she did two lots of seven and a half off the two minutes recovery and then five minutes. Uh, but you know she's obviously been doing other stuff before this. Um, so this wasn't just a case of that, she jumped straight in at that. So she's gradually built up to, she's got to, you know, sort of 30 minutes of running. So today really was her first um, little bit of a faster type session. Um, and really she was probably running a little bit quicker than I, would, I really would have wanted her to run. But, uh, yeah, she seems fine. There's no issues, no problems from it. All looks good. The rehab program's been pretty much the same as what I've always done when I've been injured. Um, biking, swimming but mainly just on the bike really. I keep myself fit um, doing bike sessions that are like an hour long. And then I try to keep it the same as running. So say on a Monday, I would do like 4.30. Then I would do 4.30 on the bike on a Monday and then Tuesday I do a session and 20 in the evening on the bike. And then on Saturday I'll do like a 90 minute bike straight out. So it keeps the same as running. So I feel like I'm not, I'm just sustaining the level of fitness that I had when I left really. She's planning to run uh, New York Park Marathon and we want to get some preparation for that. Probably maybe racing the next week or so might be a little bit too early, so it may be more the end of the month rather than um, you know, early, earlier. I always wanted to do the New York half. Last year I wanted to do it, but it clashed with the World Cross Country. Um, and obviously I wanted to do the World Cross Country because that's only every two years now. So that's the plan. Um, I'll probably do a race before then just to see how fit I am, but we haven't decided on what yet. Coverage pace 541. Um, Charlie's wanted to run a, a half marathon for a while, and you know, I think that. You know, she was in good shape before when she could have run one and she didn't get the opportunity to do it because of other races like Great South Run, uh, 10k at uh, Edinburgh. So I think you know natural progression for Charlie is to do um, a half marathon with a view that where's that going to go in the future. I think clearly a pathway will take her down the marathon route but at the moment I think um, half marathon is where she's looking at um, in this year because she still wants to focus on running 5,000, 10,000 metres in an Olympic year. Mm. And that's the sort of main target is it for this year, the Olympics on the track? Um, well I think she had the B time for the 5,000 metres two years ago um, in 2010 so she can run the B time again that's for sure and um, whether or not she can run the A time for 5,000 metres you know I'm not too sure about yet but I certainly think that you know the B time for 10,000 metres or even the A time could be achievable but you know that really is the target we try and run the, the time over 10,000 metres. <laughs> I want to step up to a marathon eventually but obviously not for a while. <laughs>